Christmas! Right, that's the obligatory mention out of the way, let's get started with today's episode. Um, a very short while ago, Warner Bros, who are technically my new bosses, because they uh, brought Machina out, so hail Warner. Um, they all, they said they, they, all of them, all of Warner Bros got together, all the brothers, and they said, do you want to review some Lego Dimension stuff? And I was like, hell yeah, I review Lego, let's review some Lego Dimension stuff. And then they sent me a box, and I was expecting a small box like this, but it's massive, so it's on the floor, and I'm gonna unbox it in a festive way. I haven't actually opened, or I haven't built any Lego in months now, so I, I think we may have a bit of a, a Lego drop coming up, where there won't be any Lego stuff, it'll just be toy stuff, because I literally haven't built, I haven't had the fucking time to build anything. But you know, what with this? But um, yeah, I was, it was in the splinter I got in my finger. So I got a metal splinter in my finger this morning off my chair. That wasn't fun. Right, I have pre-opened the box by cutting all of the stuff, but have not peered at its contents, because I thought that was easier. Yeah, it was easier. Oh, right. Flaps, flaps, flaps. There. The first thing. Okay, I've just seen something inside the box which I don't understand, and I'll show you that next. The first thing, oh, I'll set this up wrong as well, is a Lego Dimensions poster with some writing space on the back. We'll leave that there. That'll be the nice base for all the things that I'm going to show off. Um, the next thing is Gremlins on Blu-ray. <laughs> I'm not entirely sure why they've sent me... Is it even a Warner Bros. film, Gremlins? Oh, yes, that's a Warner Bros. film. Oh, there we go. Or well, maybe they've just... <laughs> Nobody was buying it. Oh, for oh, fuck's sake. <laughs> Gremlins 2! I've, I've never seen Gremlins. It doesn't really appeal to me. But, um, I really like that fucking cover. That is a nice cover. That's that's a bit... That's a proper old-school cover. Jesus. I didn't even know there was a Gremlins 2, but all right. Uh, the next thing is, uh... Oh, that's actually... Oh, it's, it's, a, it's, a, it's a T-shirt! Not much Lego yet. It's a t-shirt of Lego Dimensions things. Look, there's Harry Potter and Weird Al Yankovic and Sue Perkins and Mr. Blobby and that one kid and Tails. Oh, all of your favourites. Just going to start building up. Oh, hang on. Wait, look, look, look. Wait, no, I've nailed it. Snow. Yeah. Christmas. I don't know if this is going to go up before or after Christmas, but whatever. Uh, next up, there's... um. Three minifigs from the Lego Dimensions starter pack, which for some reason... See, this wasn't sent to me, this gets sent to Matt, and then Matt resent it to me. So I'm assuming he's half-inched the starter pack, and has left me with the the things that he's not going to use. Okay, well, i got another Batman figure out of it, so I don't mind. There is... Alright, you'll never guess what this is. You probably, you probably won't guess what this is, because it's another t-shirt. It's a fantastic piece of where to find them t-shirt. Have I subscribed to fucking some sort of loot crate kind of thing? God, I'm fucking Bennett. Now there's a, uh, there's Mac USA, which was a, uh, I think an episode of Always Sunny in Philadelphia. I'm gonna fold that up, I'm gonna put that over there, I'm gonna fold this up, I'm gonna leave it over there, and I'm gonna go, woo, cause that's the unimportant crap. Woo, oh, don't push leg off the edge. There we go. That's the unimportant, that was the extra bits. Tidy. That was the extra bits. Now we're getting into the actual stuff. Oh, I see. Okay, the first Lego Dimensions pack is Gremlins. That's why they sent me Gremlins. Okay. It comes with an RC Racer, Gizmo, Stripe. Are they both Gremlins? They look completely different. That looks like a lizard thing. No idea. And Flash and Finish. It's a pornographic term, I believe. Yes, this is a three-in-one. These things can be a flash and finish, or a rampage record player, or Stripes Throne. Oh, so he's the baddie. Okay. Or the Scarlet Scorpion, a gadget or the RC Racer, Adventure World and Battle Arena. That's one of them. It's Gremlins. The next one is... <sighs> Fantastic Beasts and Where to Find Them, a film I've not yet seen. Um, I've got the book, because Harry Potter is a book series to me. This is Tina Goldstein. No? And The Swooping Evil! Oh, fuck me! Look at that bit. Oh yeah, it's mid-swoop and everything. So fangs, yeah, that's that's the swooping evil. That's, that, that's evil, alright? I like the gold bases for them. This is an adventure world and battle arena. Okay. Good. Ooh, it could be a creepy crawler thing. Ooh. Ooh, I'd much rather it was just swooping evil, to be perfectly honest with you. You can go over there. We've got, oh, 
Ah. E.T. I've not really paid much attention to uh, LEGO Dimension. Oh, that's a team pack. These are fun packs. Yeah, I've not paid much attention to uh, LEGO Dimensions since I got it. I know they've been releasing stuff, but it's always far too expensive. Um, yeah, E.T. A nice mini figure of E.T. And a telephone. It's called Phone Home. Just call it, it's just a phone, really. Could probably call other places than just the phone. Um, it can also turn to a mobile uplink or a supercharged satellite for that bit where E.T takes over the ion cannon and starts blasting the military guys in the face. That classic Spielbergian moment. Um, wow, we've got Adventure Time! That's... I don't watch Adventure Time. I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. Some, some people kill for that, but this is Marceline the Vampire Queen. Marceline? Yeah, Marceline the Vampire Queen. I like her... Axe bits, they look like they're separate bits, they're kind of cool. And that's the Lunatic, Lunatic Amp. I can read. Not English, but I can read. Heavy Metal Monster, a Shadow Scorpion, or the Lunatic Amp. You get to build it into whatever you want. I would be opening these and showing you things, but you actually don't get the instructions for these inside. If I'm rightly from Lego Dimensions, you actually have to do that on the game. Uh, next one. Ugh. That one's bigger, that one's better. This is a story pack. I've not actually seen anything like this before, so this is new. Fantastic Beast, and where to find them? Play the complete movie. It's got Niffler, Newt Scalamander, and Makuza. Mac, oh, hang on, that was on the shirt. Mac USA. It's the, uh, Magicians and Conjurers USA. Probably doesn't stand for that because the wizards aren't they? Have a look at the back. Yeah, Niffler could be a Sinister Scorpion. Oh, don't we have a Sinister Scorpion already? Where's you? Oh, no. I saw Sinister Scorpion somewhere, didn't I? I was Swooping Evil. Did somebody else have a Sinister Scorpion? I don't know. Or a Vicious Vulture. They were very vicious, these fantastic beasts. And yeah, this is Explore, Race, Collect in the Adventure World. Challenge your friends and all that kind of crap. So this is six all new levels of wizarding fun. And you have to build a big backing bit for it. Interesting. I'll actually give that one a pop. I uh, quite like Harry Potter's world. The films did a very good job of bringing it to life. They didn't do a very good job of telling the story. They did a very good job of bringing it to life. Right. I'm just going to move all this stuff out of the way because all of that was unimportant. None of that matters because, ladies and gentlemen, here is a thing that's in the box as well. I think that's actually what uh, her face holds. Wild style, that's the one. That's not the important bit. The important bit... Oh. Ladies and gentlemen, I gently kicked the camera there in anticipation. Sonic the Hedgehog is finally in LEGO! Now, I'm not super excited about playing this. It's a level pack, so it's actually got levels to it as well. There will probably be a video on this at some point, because uh, it's fucking Sonic the Hedgehog, man. Comes with his Sonic Speedster and the Tornado! Sonic the Hedgehog! And then get Crab Meat, Egg Catcher, Blue Typhoon, and Motobug. Oh, the hell the hell. Anyway, that's not important, because I'm going to open this one up. Eh, so you didn't prepare this one, because... I didn't get the... Scissors! Santa! There we go. I didn't know what was in this. It been less fun. Oh, shit. Ah. <laughs> that fell majestically. So, yeah, the instructions are very thin. They're like, go in the game and do some stuff. Yeah. So that's useless. So that's useless. So that's... Oh, no, he's inside the thing. Cock. You have to now dig it out. Oh, that's a... Oh, that's a whole pretty piece in the front of his car. Hang on a second, I need to get some Tupperware to put this in. Tupperware update! I didn't actually get any Tupperware to put the Lego in. I actually used the cell tape off of the box and cell tape the bag back closed. Ah, oh, yeah, professionalism. Right, I've got here some legs. -na 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 -na. I've got here a torso. That's a bit less exciting, the legs look better. -na 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 -na. And ladies and gentlemen, I have got a minifigure head. Sonic the Hedgehog, which is kind of just a regular 3D molded head. Stick that on there, and there we you see. It looks from this thing that was like you're like that's a really nicely three D model thing, and you see that and you're like oh that kind of looks like Sonic, and then you put them together and you go something's not quite right. This this is a completely different color to his arms. Isn't that supposed to be the exact same color? That feels weird. That feels strange that that is a completely different color. I'm gonna check the box. Yes, the box says it's gonna look like that, and I've got this kind of a Grey torso one. Oh, it's limited edition. People on eBay will buy it. Um, yeah, I'm not super keen on the 3D model head to the straight into the squareness of the Lego body. 
Kind of wish they'd done something with just a regular head, or maybe giving us just maybe a little neck piece as well. It didn't come with a neck piece or anything. No, maybe just a little bit of a neck thing. Maybe some sort of bandana or sash that he could have worn. Oh, it's like disappointing. That's a shame. I do like his legs. He's just sitting down there, just kicking around. Shouldn't have done Sonic Boom. No, you should not. No, you should not. And there's the back of him where he's got his uh, back breasts. Actually, hang on, let's spin him around. Maybe that'll look better. Yeah. There we go. It's Sonic's mum! Hey! I ruined it, didn't I?